Hi, I'm Larry Payne. I'd like to welcome you back to the video portion of our monthly newsletter. And today I'm with my sister Lisa, who is a Prime of Life yoga teacher in Austin, Texas, and has also been a model in many of the Yoga for Dummies versions, and she's all over the world. So we're proud to have her here. Thanks, Larry. You're welcome. So today's mini workshop is going to be about a principle called PNF, proprioceptive neuromuscular facilitation. And uh, we're going to be doing it on the ground as a demonstration, and I'll talk to you about many versions of this. Hi, our topic today is the principle of dynamic and static, which I learned from my teacher, TKV Deskachar. So what you do is you move in and out of yoga postures before you hold them for a number of reasons. One, it prepares the joints safer. But two, if you tighten a muscle before you stretch it, it'll go further. And to demonstrate that point, I'm going to show you the isometric version and the isotonic version. So with isometric, if you raise your left leg, first, Lisa is very flexible. So you can see she goes further than most people on normal. Now the isometric is when you push against a fixed force. Okay? So if you push against my hand, eight seconds, Three, two, one. Watch what happens when she releases. Even more flexible. Okay. Now you can get that same principle by doing this yourself by moving the leg slowly up as you exhale, slowly down as you inhale. So you're going to see that what prevents her leg from crashing to the floor is it has to tighten enough to keep it from crashing. So that's the isotonic version. So you're moving with a little resistance. It'll give you the same type of reaction. You'll be able to go further. So this is the principle of dynamic and static. And from a scientific standpoint, you would call this proprioceptive neuromuscular facilitation, or PNF. That's why we say PNF, because it's easier to say. <laughs>